Well, good evening, everybody. Uh, what a beautiful day we had today. Uh, hit the 60s. That's pretty impressive. Uh, but I just want to take a few minutes today to follow up on my last Facebook Live video where I talked about Tim Tebow's book, Today's the Day. And in that book, Tim Tebow talked about how to set goals for uh, our lives, how to live each day with a purpose. And so that got me thinking about what is success. Um, I think we all have a definition of what success is. But one of my favorite models, I'm just going to go over in the next five to ten minutes here, is that of uh, John Robert Wooden. Um, his uh, pyramid of success is pretty impressive. Now, at first, you might be wondering, who is John Robert Wooden? Well, he was actually a basketball coach for uh, UCLA, and he won ten national championships with them. And what I love about John Robert Wooden is not only his skill as a basketball coach, but also Wooden's ability to, to really define success, to, to give us 15 building blocks about what success is and how to live in a life that's really beyond ourselves. Uh, so if you look at this model here at the pyramid of uh, success that John Robert Wooden lays out for us, the two bottom blocks here are the cornerstones. Um, first one is industriousness. Talks about success travels in the company of very hard work. There is no trick, no easy way. So his first cornerstone says industriousness is a huge component of success. And then he goes to say uh, that enthusiasm is a huge part of it as well. So the very two cornerstones of this entire pyramid of success that John Robert Wooden lays out is that build up, that is built on hard work but also enthusiasm. Uh, doing things in a way uh, that show energy, enjoyment, drive, dedication, and ultimately that inspires others. So this is something you can definitely look up online but I'll read through these really quick and this again is John Robert Wooden's pyramid of success. Um, so the first one is industriousness, so hard work, friendship, loyalty, cooperation, enthusiasm, then go to the next level, self-control, alertness, initiative, intentness, condition, skill, team spirit, poise, confidence, and competitive greatness. So here is that pyramid for John Robert Wooden. It's, um, you know, you often hear about pyramid scheme, schemes and these crazy ideas, but this is a guy who coached UCLA as an NCAA head coach, won 10 national championships, and I'm sure he lost some games. I'm sure there were moments in practices or in games that were stressful, that were difficult. And so I know that John Robert Wooden developed this, this methodology for success and for defining how to achieve success through experience, through the good moments and through the challenging moments. Um, if, if you look at this model online, if you want to pull it up as I'm reading through it, find the building blocks that are a strength for you. So is self-control something that's a strength for you? Is loyalty a strength for you? Uh, team spirit. But now there are 15 of these building blocks. So out of the 15, I know there are areas that I need to work on and improve in. And I also know that uh, those who are watching this have strengths, but also areas that they can improve in. So um, if you're on your phone, go ahead and pull up this. Uh, it's John Robert Wooden's Pyramid of Success. And again, it's not some a crazy scheme. It's, uh, <laughs> it's proven experience. It's proven results. And... Um, one of my favorite quotes that Wooden says here, he says, ultimately that success is a peace of mind which is a di direct result of self-satisfaction in knowing you made the effort to become the best of which you are capable. So look at that one more time. Success is self-satisfaction. Success is knowing that you put in the effort to be the best you're capable of being. And so that's what Wooden tells us in all of his experience and all of his ups and downs. And I really thought this was a great build off from Tim Tebow's book that we went through a few weeks ago of being intentional, of winning every day, of learning every day. 
And um, so what I've challenged myself to do is in order to learn and grow in these 15 blocks uh, that John Wooden shares with us, I took a few that I can work on and improve on, and I'm going to dedicate some uh, some time over the next few weeks to grow in these areas. Uh, so is it the area of maybe initiating things for you, maybe being more cooperative, as that's one of the building blocks here. So um, yeah, go ahead and Google John uh, Robert Wooden's Pyramid of Success, and you'll see that it's really inspiring. It's really cool to see a, a very successful NCAA coach go through his experience as a coach, but then also offer some of that advice to us. And in, in success, it's ultimately up to you, right? It's, it's um, thank you, Wendy, for sharing uh, that, that model in the comments there. That helps a lot. So go ahead, click on Wendy's link. Um, but yeah, so in all, here are those 15 building blocks of what is success, of uh, John Wooden's definition of the pyramid of success. It's hard work, industriousness, it's friendship, loyalty, cooperation, enthusiasm, self-control, alertness, initiative, intenseness, uh, intentness, so being more intent with things that we do, uh, Condition, and this one's kind of interesting. Condition says, ability may get you to the top, but character keeps you there. Mental, moral, and physical condition. So as a coach, he talks about physical conditioning a lot, but in this example, it says that being conditioned is to be able to be on top of your game mentally, um, physically, morally. So I think that's a really cool call out that Wooden says here. Skill. Uh, he says, what a leader learns after you've learned, um, what a leader learns after you've learned it all counts most of all. So ultimately, what you've learned is what counts. Team spirit. The star of the team is the team. Uh, let's see here. We supersedes me. So again, that teamwork, that unity is so key. Uh, poise. Be yourself. Don't throw out, uh, don't be thrown off by events, whether good or bad. Uh, confidence. The strongest steel is well-founded. Self-belief is earned, not given. And then competitive greatness. So uh, those are my few takeaways uh, on on John Robert Wooden here with uh, his thoughts behind what is success. And ultimately, as you saw a lot of these building blocks, you probably saw a common theme and the common theme is that success is up to us it's how we are uh, in our morals it's how we are mentally and it's how we are to those around us and what I really love about this really successful basketball coach who gives us these encouraging skills and the, these encouraging reminders of how to, to succeed he ultimately comes back to this and he says there is only one kind of life that truly wins, and that is one that puts, uh, that places faith in hands of the Savior. So for him, his faith was a huge part of his ups and downs, of his challenges, of his successes. And so, yeah, so I share John Robert Wooden's Pyramid of Success, his experiences with you, uh, not to say that we, you know, we should look down on ourselves because we don't have it all together or we haven't reached the place where we want to be. But ultimately, when you bring it full circle, the, these 15, 15 building blocks are key. But for John Robert Wooden and all of his success in the 10 national championships as a winning coach for UCLA, he says the one kind of life that truly wins, that truly succeeds, is one that places its faith in the hands of Savior. And so that's my biggest encouragement to you is to evaluate um, not only what is driving you, what's um, making you or uh, encouraging you to be more successful, but really evaluate uh, what's driving your morals, what's driving your attitude towards others. Uh, because as Wooden says, conditioning is not just only physical, it's uh, also mental, it's moral, and ultimately it's about your character. 
so yeah, so to me, uh, my faith and my relationship with Jesus Christ is a huge foundation for all of this. Uh, and I was really encouraged by John Robert Wood and it's not only um, goal setting for us of what we can achieve in striving for success, but also his faith, his foundation in placing his life and his ups and downs in the hands of Jesus. And um, yeah, that's my, my encouragement to you. Uh, definitely explore, definitely seek if you're not there. I'm happy to answer any questions. Uh, but yeah, that's what success means to me. It's a lot of um, what John Robert Wooden talks about in his Pyramid of Success, but ultimately what he says in putting our lives in a relationship with Jesus Christ. So I hope this was helpful. If, uh, if you have any questions, definitely send me a message or a comment here and uh, enjoy the rest of this, this beautiful day. Thank you guys.